You're a man that'll remember this bus well, will you? <laughs> I feel like we're going to ride a stage of the tour. Shit, we are. Good morning and welcome to what is possibly going to be the first of many cycling tips vlogs. We're here just outside, or I'm here I should say, just outside Grenoble. We're here for what is going to be a pretty hard job today, bike testing. Do you, do you have your preferred seat on I here? do actually have a preferred seat, back left corner, that's where I am sat and won the Tour de France once, back in, back in, you know. Back in the day. Back, back when I was a good rider, but no, no, we all have our space and our habits and this is exactly going to a race in the morning. Normally I'd be more on time, that's the important thing, actually we've got three minutes to go, so Let's we're actually on, perfect on time. <laughs> well, you used to sit here or here? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, you have your priority, do you sit in the comfortable seat or do you sit in a space where you have space? Like, I, like, I like the less comfortable seat but then you can get your things ready on the way to the race. Yeah, you, you were used to sleep at the back of the Yeah, normally, side. yeah, I'm, yeah. there I've got heaps of space, back corner, no one can disturb me. George across the aisle from me. George, what other shirt should we wear today? I can't decide. That was the normal. Got the grub, we're ready. Roll out from Murray or Muir, I'm not sure. I'll flip up the route here, but we got a bloody lot of case. So we were meant to go over the Galibier, we're not. It's snowing, I'm going to get dropped by Cadell and everybody else, I think, because I'm pretty unfit. Let's have a good day riding. Top the first climb, so it's bike tinkering time. Everyone working out if the the bikes that we got given yesterday fit well. Seat posts are coming out. Stems are being adjusted. And Cadell's being interviewed. One down. How, how many more to go? Uh, three more to go. Yeah. Easy. But well, this is the, this no this is the easy one. <laughs> Let, 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 let me check all my technology I got here, wire, uh, Bluetooth and everything. Bit of paper. Bit of paper. <laughs> so this is stage 17 of this year's tour, is it? Or 18? Stage 17 of the 2017 Tour de France, apparently. Do you, do you watch any of it or just catch little glimpses? Um, sadly, if you have a choice of going out and riding my bike or staying home and sitting on the couch and watching a bike race on TV, I always choose going for a ride. Wise man. <laughs> okay, who on the team, on the BMC team, is really particular about their equipment? Is there anybody in particular that really likes their gear? Yeah, I think currently Greg is really one of the guys that can give very precise uh, feedback. But I still remember working with Cadell, this was really unique. I mean, he was he was a guy who could tell 2-3% differences in stiffness and compliance things that usually we can only measure in the lab but he could exactly tell the ranking between the different so you did you balance. used to do tests with him like try and trick him into knowing what frame was what blind tests as such yeah we did full blind tests with the previous generation of uh, team machine where we were we color coded the products we swapped different forks different seat posts different frames and just took his feedback and when we came back and did the analysis we actually realized that there was a 100% match in what he felt to what we measured in the lab. And I think for this, Cadell was really, and still is, a unique athlete and a great asset for BMC. Okay. Little bit of a screw up. There's a roadblock, so we're having to come over the Mollard. Much to my legs. Monad. Monad. <laughs> oh, you're happy though, aren't you? Yeah. It's empty. I'm okay. I'm fine. It's good. Good time. I like this part of uh, 
for friends. Definitely a good area for training. We'll return for the tour. But you're not doing a recon now, going to come over this. Yeah, but that's always that's the thing. When you do the recon in May, you always have to do some day tour because they just opened the big mountain passes. So you know you're gonna be surprised at one point. So like this, it's okay. Just an 8k climb day tour. Easy. <laughs> it means more training, more climbing for me, which is good. Lunch stop, St. Jean de Maureen, and that is about how work good I feel at the moment. I feel I could join them guys down there. Six hours. Not too bad, man. Time for lunch, eh? Yesterday, I was on the, the disc brake version of this. Today, rim brakes, mechanical. It's all old school. <laughs> let's see how it let's see how it performs. We've got 20k of climbing, 20k of descending. If that's it, that's it. If that isn't enough for a test, I don't know what is. <laughs> I'm watching that rear hub, watching that rear hub. <laughs> this some guy in a BMC kit, guessing he's a fan. <laughs> do, you ever, do you ever get abuse out on the road, people shouting at you? Oi, what are you wearing a team kit for? All the time. Hub watch, and it's vanished. 13 k's in, on the upside, I have thrown a snowball at the photographer. He's got a drone with him, 3D camera on his head. You won't believe who we've bumped into here. Charlie Mott. Okay. What have you been doing since racing then? Since your oh, racing uh, days? I take a picture like a cameraman on my bike yeah. <laughs> for Orange, so for, want... for the Tour de France, you know. Because they're the sponsor, obviously, of the, one, of, one exactly. of the sponsors for the Tour de France. Exactly. Okay, will you be at the Tour de France? Uh, it's only for the downhill, yeah. uh, the top of the Isoar to Cast Desert. Okay, so you'll remember all these climbs from yes. your days of racing. Do you have any particular memories of this this climb in there? The yes, Isoar it's, at home? yes, it's uh, it's uh, eighty nine, I think. We arrived at uh, Briançon, yeah, and uh, we climbed by this way by Cast Desert. And uh, with Greg Lemon, Laurent Fignon, and uh, it was a, a strong uh, race. Yeah, because that uh, was the year Greg Lemon won. In the won, of up, uh, and, the, and this climb, and also in the downhill. Very, very fast. Yeah, so I'll let you do your work. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, Maybe see you at the Tour de France. Yes, probably. Thank you. Awesome. Pleasure. We thought we were stupid. Crazy. Right, last little bit to camera. That's it. We're descended. We're here back at the hotel. All over. Rim brake versus disc brake, read the review, but to sum it up, if it was my money, I'd be going rim brake. But I put that all in the review to get, let you know why, but yeah, I really enjoyed the rim brake. Okay, till the next vlog, thank you for watching.